And the figure above AB is equal to AC. E is the midpoint of AB and D is the midpoint of AC. If A is equal to X and ED is equal to 4, what is length BC? Now here's where you really got to pay attention to them saying figure is not drawn to an accurate scale. Because they tell you E is the midpoint of AB, but that sure as fuck don't look like the middle of AB. Same for point D. But they tell us AE is X, which would mean that EB is going to be X. They also tell us ED is 4. They want to know the length of BC. The formula for this situation is you just multiply by 2. To go from a side from the smaller triangle to a side from the bigger triangle. So we didn't even need to bother labeling anything with the X's. You just have to know that when you have two midpoints being joined like this, you take any side from the smaller triangle and multiply it by two to get the matching side from the bigger triangle. That fact comes from similar triangles, and you can prove that these two triangles are similar, by the way. But if you do accept it, then you can set up a proportion. The ratio of any two matching sides from similar triangles is always equal. The 4 matches up with the W, but the X matches up with X plus X, that's AB. So that's 2X. So let's solve this for W. We can't, because there's two variables. I'm only fucking with you, the X's cancel. Which means it doesn't actually matter what X is, it just matters that you have a midpoint. So now we got W over 4 is equal to 2, which means W is equal to 4 times 2. So this proves that W is just equal to 4 times 2. So we just have to multiply by 2. For this formula to work, it didn't have to be 4. It could have been anything. And if it was anything, then you would just take that anything and multiply it by 2. 